Hello everyone, today I'm gonna show you how to make pop-up animation. This is actually my first tutorial on the YouTube channel. I am really excited about it. Here is my pop-up animation. In this tutorial, I'm not going to show all of this temple. I'll only show the top part of the temple. Before starting the animation, you have to implement the vector file which can be done in Adobe Illustrator. Once you have the vector, you need to click the circle icon on the layer to select all vectors. After that, click on the three lines from the top right corner of the layer box. And then click on the release to layers sequence. Now you can see each of these vectors in a different color and separated layers. But still under the same original layers. So that, select those layers and drag and drop them above the original main layer. Then delete the original layer. Now you are ready to create animation in Adobe After Effect. In After Effect, double click on the project and then select the vector file that you created. Make sure you choose the composition retain layer sizes. First, you have to arrange the layers, the top object always has to be on the top layer. The second one has to be second. Make sure all the layers in order. Once you arrange all the layers, you need to change the anchor point of each layer. The anchor point needs to be at the bottom of each object. Change the anchor point of each layer. After that, you need to attach each layer. The top layer links to the second layer. Second one link to the third one. Do it until the bottom layer. We have to select all the layers. Then press S. Now we need to remove the chain icon from the scale of each layer because I don't want the constrained proportions which maintain the aspect ratio width and height. In this animation, I'll just play the height. Once you are done removing constrained proportions of all layers, now it's ready to animate. Click on the bottom layer. Scale the height from 100 to 0. Keep the width 100. We will just play the height. Then click on the stopwatch icon. And then, move a bit in the timeline like 8 frames or 10 frames depend on how you want it. If you want it slow, you do it like 12 frames or something like that. Change the scale height back to 100. In this tutorial, I will do it at 8 frames to make it faster. Then you have to select both keyframes. After that select all the keyframes and copy and paste on the above layer a little bit to move forward in the timeline. Paste it again on another layer and do the same thing until you reach the top. Now you have the animation, but still not a smooth pop-up. So, for the final step, I need to use a plugin called Motion 2. You can see the link in the description. Now select all the keyframes from every layer. Click on the Window tab, select Motion 2. And then, Click the Excite button on the Motion 2 box. Now you have the final version of nice and smooth pop-up animation. 
I will also make a link for the project files in the description. Thank you for watching. Make sure you click on the subscribe button and turn on the notification. Thanks.